and the Buffs are going to go 1 and 0. 45 42, Shadour Sanders takes a knee, and how about this? Crime time! Dion wins his first one on the road against a team that played in the national championship one year ago. 45 42. Colorado. His son leading the way, Shadur Sanders. And I got a feeling we're going to hear some Maybach music after this. Those of you who thought it was a gimmick, it ain't a gimmick now. No, sir. Next week, Nebraska at home. 45 to 42. Deion Sanders told us yesterday. He said, the one thing I guarantee is that my team will play with effort. And that they did. What we didn't know is about the execution. And they executed, certainly on offense. And boy, they played smart in big moments. And our Jenny Taft is down with Coach Prime. Coach Prime, it doesn't get much better than this. You said all along, we come in, this team is here. And wow, did you impress. How proud are you? Thank you, Jesus. I'm so thankful right now. My son, man. My pop right here. My son, my other son. Yeah. Man, I'm loving these kids. Rick George for giving me this opportunity, man. This is a blessing. Everybody, Buff Nation, who supported us in all the hood that had my back. I thank y'all. God, this is good. <laughs> Woo! What can you tell me about your defense and the way they came up huge with that stop to get they, this win? They surrendered some big plays throughout the game, and we all we kept teaching was just we need one stop, one stop. But what about the offense? How did they respond? How did these guys respond? I don't know how many snaps he played, but we're going to put a hot tub on the plane for him to make sure he's straight. Hey, we're excited because we are heading to visit your home next week, Folsom Field. What is your message to the fans of what we can expect from Colorado? We told you we're coming. We told you we're coming. You thought we was joking. And guess what? We keep receipts. God bless you, America. Ooh, God is good. Congratulations. I want to hear from you guys. Tell me about your dad, about playing for him, and what you guys just accomplished today, Shiloh. Uh, just like he said, we just believe everything he taught us. We went out there and executed everything he's telling us. Every damn practice, he put us in those situations in practice, and we've been able to practice and critique that. And so now we just show the fans what we got. Shador, you set records today, over 500 yards. I mean, you made it look easy, and you told me you were ready to capitalize on this moment. How would you describe it? Man, it's a real feeling because we knew it the whole time. I'm practicing against the best corner in the world. You know, so my margin of error, error versus him is very small. I can't I can't miss too far inside, too far outside because he's going to make a play. But it's just like nobody believed in us, man, and it, it just showed me a lot about how people is. And they let names and they let power five and stuff get to their head. I think this is the highest passing yards I had in my life. I was just at HBCU, you know what I mean? So they didn't believe us, but they, who did? They didn't believe us, you God know what I mean? But did. God did, you know what I'm saying? God Travis, you said you were going to follow Coach Prime wherever he was going to go, and he could not say enough about you and your skill. How do you do it, play on both sides and make it look easy? Hey, I just believe. I mean, I've been playing football since I was four years old. My dad and my mom stayed on me. My dad was at every game getting on me, so I just believed in what they taught me when I was younger and just came up with it. Are you tired right now? No, nah, I'm not tired. I'm ready to go back again. Okay, congratulations, you guys. Uh, we got another one. Uh, Dylan? Dylan, congratulations. I mean, unbelievable performance, those touchdowns. And Coach Prime told us that you were going to be special today just to wait for your moment. How would you describe this one and this performance for you? I mean, I'm blessed. I'm glad I came here. Everybody executed their plays. Yeah, we had mistakes, but we came out here and did our thing, and we on to next week. On to next week. What should the fan base know about you guys? We are coming to visit you in Boulder. That we coming. I feel like today was, you know, a proven point that we can do this and we will do this and we can't wait till next week. Congratulations. Go enjoy it. Thank you.